I so wish that I had been able to fulfill your hopes to lead the country in a different direction, but the nation chose another leader. As Republicans looked to move past their stinging presidential loss, they were faced with a bleak reality. The U.S. voting population is rapidly growing more diverse with every election. And if the party that historically relied so heavily on white and male voters doesn't find a way to appeal to a broader demographic, it could face serious political peril. Out of the gate this morning, what you're already starting to see is the Republicans doing some serious soul searching or starting the process of soul searching over who is our party, what do we believe, and how do we make it more hospitable to a broader tent of people. Exit polls Tuesday revealed a voting makeup that basically mirrored that of four years ago, when Obama shattered minority voting barriers and drove historic numbers of young voters to the polls. But the number of white voters which Romney banked on for a win was down two percentage points from four years ago, while the number of black voters remained steady and Hispanics increased along with their population. Over the coming weeks, coming months, and in fact the next couple of years, the Republican Party is going to have to figure out how it can appeal more effectively to this fast-growing demographic group. At the same time, it's not just Latinos. For the second presidential election in a row, Republicans fell way short in their appeals to both women and young voters, crucial voting blocks that helped decide the election. Now, what is our party doing about expanding our numbers and reaching those groups? Longtime Florida Representative Ileana Ross Layton, the first Hispanic woman elected to Congress, says it's time her party gets with the program. We need to get with the times. We need to wake up and say, dude, where's my party? My party is in the 1950s. They're with Ozzie and Harriet. They're with my three sons. They're with Bewitched. They haven't woken up to the fact that the changing demographics of this country are changing the politics of this country. Ross Layton warns her party needs to do a better job reaching out to Hispanics, women, and other key demographics today, or risk becoming a losing party for the foreseeable future. Kelly Daschle, Associated Press.